Hello, all my fantastic, amazing viewers. I love you all. It's been a really long time since I've done any sort of update or really done anything online. Um, I I don't feel like I need to explain myself. I feel like I want to explain myself. I'm, I want to do this more often. I almost want this to be like a, a diary for myself. This is for me. If people enjoy knowing what's going on with me, that's a bonus. But this is purely for me. Okay? So... I guess the last thing I said was admitting that I have terrible anxiety, etc. Since then, I have seen a doctor. I bought, I've got a prescription. The prescription I got completely threw me off. It, it unbalanced me. It made me not want to socialize. It made me agoraphobic. It made me essentially bedridden, except not bedridden because I have been sleeping on my couch. It just completely ruined me, and I was like that for five weeks. I've been on this medication for seven weeks, now I'm finally balancing out, but for five weeks, I didn't want to leave my couch, I didn't want to see my friends, I didn't want to talk to my family, I'd go up to dinner at my mother's, and like an hour in, I just wanted to get the fuck out, and that is nothing like me. I love people, I love being around people, I love talking to people, even though I was anxious about talking to people, I loved talking to people, and it's been gone. So, for the people who have been wondering why I haven't been streaming... It's because I've been completely off. I have not been myself at all. And the people who have been pushing me to stream, it, it hasn't helped. It's just added stress. Just so you know, it's just, it's just added stress. So, um, so I've been, I've not been myself at all. Um, I've had these sort of, what, well, essentially what's happening right now is I've had these moments of motivation and sanity in the in a sea of insanity actually like the the beard that's going on is not is not because i want to grow a beard it's because i've been too lazy to do anything about it and now it's grown a lot enough that i guess i can keep it like it's just so so i have these moments of sanity these moments of motivation these moments of clarity which i'm having right now so i i can see all the failures i can see all the struggles i can see all the trouble I can see the solution, but I know in a few hours, I'm going to go to bed. It's, cur it's currently 6.30 in the morning. I've not been to sleep yet. This is, this is how crazy I am, okay? Well, I, should, I shouldn't say the word crazy. It, I'm a bit crazy. So I'm having this, this moment of sanity, which I'm now documenting, where I can see what needs to be done. I can see my issues. But I know when I wake up tomorrow, I'm going to be back into this, this cloud of lack of motivation, this, this haze of medicated nothing. And I, I don't know what to do about it. I, I need to get motivated, I need to get back on my life again, but I'm worried if I get off the drugs, I'll go back to the anxious person that I was, but if I stay on the drugs, I'll become this lazy person that I've become. And because I, it, I've been doing this for seven weeks now, I don't know. I don't know if I'm getting back to normal over the last two weeks, or I don't know if I'm just getting used to being abnormal, being not myself, because I don't feel like myself at all, and I don't know what to do. I'm completely lost currently. I don't know what to do. I haven't slept in my bed for probably six weeks. For six weeks, I've been unable to sleep properly, and the only way I've been able to fall asleep is putting on a streamer Netflix on my couch. I have slept on my couch for almost two months. I have not slept in my own bed. I don't know what's going on. I'm so confused. And the people, the people that supported me for the first two weeks of this struggle have now turned to, what are you doing with your life? You need to get moving. You need to change. You need to do this, they pushed, and the harder they pushed, the more I push back and the more difficult it is. So I'm, I'm in this loop of inactivity. And every time someone tries to help me get out of it, it just pushes me further in. That, so that's where I'm at. I don't know what else to say, really. So seven weeks, seven weeks in to this medication, I am... A bundle of crazy. I don't know what to do. 
I will be back my next moment of sanity to update you guys on where I'm at. Thank you for listening. Remember, this is, this is, this is, this is an exercise for myself to try and put down my thoughts and, and regain myself. Thank you.